Hello, my name is Prashant Raghavendra. I'm a technical marketing engineer in the Cisco SD-WAN team. This video demonstrates how to configure a single router site with UX2.0. UX2.0 takes a fresh approach for site configuration, which is simple, reusable, and structured. It uses the configuration group and feature profiles construct for site configuration. There is also a workflows library. A workflow is a collection of guided steps to help you perform a certain task easily. In Site 300, there is a device which is neither attached to a template nor a configuration group. We will use the Create Configuration Group workflow to create and deploy the configuration to this device. The Create Configuration Group workflow has three distinct phases. First, create the configuration group. Then, associate the devices to the configuration group. And lastly, deploy the configuration to the devices. A configuration group is essentially a logical grouping of devices that is defined based on business needs. It could be region-based, function-based, size-based, and so on. Here, we will create a configuration group based on region. For example, US West. This is the main page in the workflow where a predefined single router site configuration is made available for you. Only some of the site configuration is exposed and the rest is set up as per Cisco recommended smart defaults. You can edit the configuration if you wish or proceed to the next step if the predefined configuration is acceptable to you. Notice how the sidebar and status icon change color to indicate incomplete or invalid configuration. Let us configure the site with two WAN transports and two service VPNs. The summary page can be used to review the site configuration that will be created. Click on Create Configuration Group. So in three clicks, the site configuration is created. At this point, the workflow can be terminated and the association and deploy phases can be done later or Continue with the associate and deploy phases right now. Let us continue with the workflow. In the associate devices phase, the devices to be associated with this configuration group are selected. The selection is reviewed and confirmed. In the provision devices phase, devices to be deployed with this configuration group are selected. Device specific configuration is provided, reviewed, and confirmed. The export import CSV file option is available for bulk deployment. The preview CLI feature shows the complete device configuration in CLI format, including a side-by-side -side diff and an export or copy option. Clicking on deploy will start the configuration deployment. The status of the task can be seen with view deployment status. The device in site 300 is now assigned to the US West configuration group. The workflow created one configuration group, which is made up of three essential feature profiles a significant reduction in the configuration artifacts. You can also view or edit the configuration group, add new features to the feature profiles, or view or edit existing features in the feature profiles. Thank you for watching.